myself professor pawar bk from department of geography jt art science and commerce college for women maligao on behalf of this video presentation i welcome you all dear students in today's video we'll deal with the topic consumerism and waste products first of all we'll see the introductory part of this consumerism and waste products one of the prime reasons for our destructive impacts on the global environment is our consumption pattern and disposal of wastes fordism of 1920s to 1960s emphasized mass production mass consumption corporate control and resource exploitation but since 1960s economists environmentalists and various thinkers have raised the question on growing consumerism that is excessive consumption stimulated or increased through marketing earlier societies used to consume much less resources but with the dawn of industrial era consumerism has shown an exponential rise the modernization in the lifestyles of the people has further increased the demand of consumer products and their consumption the indian society is fast adapting to western societies where packed foods and other goods are a common practice this leads to the generation of solid wastes solid wastes are resulted mainly from industries agriculture urban localities and domestic activities the water products may be sewage industrial wastes agricultural wastes hazardous wastes packing refuse such as poly bags etc now we'll deal with the subunit that is the world consumerism pattern what is the consumerism patterns we'll see in details world consumerism patterns vary in more developed countries and less developed countries in more developed countries population size is smaller while resources are in abundance and due to luxurious life styles the people living in these countries consume much more resources than the people living in the less developed countries more the consumption of resources more is waste generation and greater is the degradation of the environment in less developed countries the condition is just reverse but the excessive population living in these countries causes more consumption of limited resources since their overall consumption is high they generate more waste products the sum total of environmental impact of these two types of consumerism may be the same or may be greater than of more developed countries although consumption patterns vary from country to country but usa is known for the highest rate of consumerism the throw away attitude and luxurious lifestyles of the people of western countries not only increase their consumption rate but also the rate of waste generation and environmental degradation there is a vast difference in consumerism and waste generation pattern between india and america consumerism pattern in usa and india if we compare we'll get the data now the parameters if you see the population of usa is 4.7 whereas india is 16 and production of goods in america if you see it is 21 whereas in india it is 1 energy use in america it is 25 whereas in india it is only 3 pollutants or waste products generated in america are 25 whereas in india it's only 3 cfc's production if you see it is 22 in usa and whereas in india it is 0.7 it is evident from this data that 
although population of India is 3.4 times more than that of USA, its overall energy use and waste generation are less than one eighth that of USA. Thus, more consumption leads to more waste generation. On an average, a US citizen consumes 50 times as much as an Indian. A US born baby due to high consumption pattern will damage the earth's environment 20 to 100 times more in its lifetime than a baby born in a poor family of a less developed country. A Japanese with similar lifestyle as that of an American causes half the impact on environment due to improved eco-friendly technology, adoption of energy efficiency and following SR principle. 3R principle. 3R principle means reduce, reuse and recycle. 